Good morning, this is Connor from Zero DTE Traders here to present our Market Minute for May 24th, 2023. It is 2.40 and the SPX is down about 8 tenths of a percent to 41.13. Uh, it's been a fairly quiet session here thus far. Um, of course, we opened with a gap down and we saw some selling pressure uh, at the open here, but the market has held uh, the big 4100 handle just basing sideways here um, in a fairly low volatility type structure. Now, it was our base case today that 4100 was going to hold um, or more specifically that in order for 4100 to break there needs to be some sort of catalyst now of course we got the debt ceiling talks going on uh, at the moment they've been going on for much of the afternoon here so i think a big part of the reason we're not seeing the vol is that traders are in wait and see mode at this juncture right we're waiting for clarity on the debt ceiling some headlines to come through um, and vol has clearly stayed elevated to um, you know, VIX holding above the big 20 handle. So I don't know if we're going to get any headlines coming through into the close here, uh, but we're most certainly on high alert. Um, now, we traded credits this morning. Uh, matter of fact, we were liking the short put trade below the big 4100 handle. Um, I just took one trade. We definitely had traders, you know, scalp in this with the short puts all morning and I guess into the afternoon here. I only took one. Um, and this was basically the double bottom here. I, I actually missed this entry, which was cycle low. Um, you know, by the time I saw it, we were up here. So I didn't chase it, but I waited for a pullback. And well, I got in uh, basically on the double bottom here and sold out on the move higher, cycle high. Now, I did not flip short here. Uh, there's just not the volatility. Uh, nor the premium at this juncture, uh, you know, coming into the end of the day uh, to really be trading these swings, at least not enough for me to justify the trade. Um, so it was just a one trade for me, um, and it took me a while before I decided, okay, you know, I'm going to come out and sell vol. Um, and at that time, we did see vol compressed a little bit, but as mentioned, still holding up here uh, as participants are waiting for more clarity. Now, I think it's important to be deploying you know the right strategies in this environment if there's not much vol right and there's a reason for vol to stay somewhat muted you may want to be a little bit cautious on trading those butterflies right it's generally a, a credit spread type day short vol although with that being said you also risk vol spike right some vol shocks in the market if a headline comes across the wire so this is definitely a tricky environment to trade, one where you most certainly want to be a little bit more cautious and, and really pay close attention to your news feed. Um, and that's what we were doing here today, but uh, we clearly haven't had any shocks. So that's it, the one trade for me, I'm calling it a day. Um, so that was in 160, out 65 on the move higher. Again, I sold the 4100 uh, put five wide. So if you're not a member and you're interested in learning more, you can visit our website at zerodtetraders.com. Best of luck out there today.